how to crochet the simple scallop edging stitch. For this stitch, you'll need a crochet hook and a ball of yarn. Special thanks to our sponsor, Knit Spot, for providing today's yarn. Today we are using their Bare Naked Wools line in the color Oatmeal. For this stitch, you'll need to know the following techniques. Chain stitch, single crochet, double crochet. To begin this stitch, you must create a foundation chain in multiples of four. Now to start out this pattern, we're going to do a prep row. So we'll begin by doing a double crochet into the sixth chain from our hook. So that's four, five, six. All right, and then we're going to start our repeat by chaining one. Then we will skip the next chain and then do a double crochet into the chain after that. And we'll repeat this sequence all the way across to the end of the row. Row one, we're going to begin by chaining one. Then we'll do one single crochet into the next double crochet, that's the one that's right below it. Then we are going to start our repeat by chaining five. One, two, three, four, and five. Then we're going to skip the next double crochet, that's this one right here, and we will do a single crochet into the double crochet after that. Like so. All right, so we're going to repeat this sequence all the way to the last double crochet in our row. All right, when we reach the end of our row, we're going to chain five. Then we're going to skip the next double crochet and the next chain stitch, this one right here, and we'll finish by doing a single crochet into the chain stitch after that. Okay, then we're going to re turn our work. Row 2, we're going to begin by chaining 1. Then we're going to do a single crochet into the first single crochet in our row. Then we'll do 7 single crochets into the next 5 chain loop. And this is going to start our repeat. So We've got 2, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, then we'll do one single crochet into the next single crochet. And we'll re repeat this sequence all the way to the end of the row. So we'll finish up by doing a single crochet into the last single crochet. Then you can cut your yarn and finish off. And that will complete our simple scallop edging stitch. Want more New Stitch Today? Check out our website at newstitchaday.com.